Welcome to another episode of the Storma Games. I am your host, Vega. We're going to be playing through a fun little arcade game today called Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time. And this is the four-player uh, version of it. Okay, so I'm starting on with this screen. Just to mess with the settings a little bit. I'm a settings guy, so I like to always make sure everything's tweaked just right. Default setting for this here is one credit, gives you two lives. I'm going to bump that up a little bit here. Give one credit gives me eight lives, and I'm going to turn this up to very hard difficulty. Save and exit. I don't think they have a free play on this, so we're just going to head on to the game mode. Pizza power! Oh. 
This is April on the other morning. <laughs> hey, Crank! Bring that statue back, you bloated beanbag! Alright, attack! <laughs> it's weird because the controls are the exact opposite in this game as they are in the original Ninja Turtles. The jump button is attack on this game and the attack button is jump. So I'm gonna be a little confused for a minute here. Just a two button game, so it's not like it's gonna take me forever to adjust here. I did uh, bump the bit rate up to 2300. How's everything uh, running and looking for you? Everything's still smooth and crystal clear, sounding good. Right on. Attack Ninja Turtles. Oh, I'm jumping too much. I'm trying to like attack, but I'm hitting the jump button. Reform. I see some pizza or something. Yeah, it's pizza. Pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time. That guy didn't stand a chance. Prepare to die. Oh, Krang. Getting vengeance on me from the whooping I gave him on part one. Yep, I'll even attack you, Splinter. Shredder, yeah, Splinter. Don't need to be coming on the screen when I'm in a fighting mood. Hmm. <laughs> These foot soldiers are just get annihilated on this game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You shouldn't have landed, my friend. This is not your day. It's just a mauling every time this poor guy lands. I feel bad for him. He can't do a dang thing. <clears throat> it's just a beating. Gang rape. Going down. Oh, 
Oh, this weapon's a little stronger. He can actually counterattack a little bit with it. <clears throat> Not a whole lot, but a little bit. But down here and fight like a real fly. Turtles versus fly. Oh, that was a nice charge move, all four guys. Oh, oh, get him. This is on very difficult levels, so... <clears throat> With very difficult, they mean it on the Ninja Turtles. Uh-oh! You're going down. <laughs> nice. They all face each other and say, Kawabunga. Excellent! Righteous! Radical! Alright, let's go! Yep, you guys don't stand a chance. Hey, I appreciate that, doofs. Mucho appreciante, for sure. Always gonna try to make this a high quality fun time here at the game of the Storm of Games. Oh look at the punching robots. They didn't stand a chance. They were gone before I even had time to, to promote them. Die, foot soldiers! Oh, oh, oh! You're all going down. <laughs> you were burning something. Don't be burning the house down. It's a little lengthy, but it gives time for the viewers to roll in and show up and everything. My hundreds of viewers that I have, you know. Just kidding. Pretty much a brand new stream. Just getting started off the ground. Better than that. Nice, Leonardo. Dang, this looks like the real movie when you're doing that. When you're in a group fighting them off from both sides, I was like, am I watching a Ninja Turtles cartoon or am I playing the game? Be 
Pizza time. Pizza time. <laughs> Is this IRL? Pizza time. Lots of pizza up there. It's definitely my new favorite technique. As far as visual maximizing visual awesomeness. I'm going to mangle you green slime balls. <laughs> You're going to mangle us green slime balls. Get him, Raphael. It's up to you. For heaven's sakes. You are going down, my friend. Oh, there's a hole over there. Not the place to form, turtles. Find another corner. See, this guy can fight us off when we're all grouped in as Mega Ultra Mega Turtle. Mega Ultra Super Turtle, sorry. <laughs> Keep an eye out for those holes. They are doozies. Oh, oh, you were trying to get... See, he can just blast us right off with his, with his kick. Sorry here, robotic Bruce Lee. I'll give you the old one, two. Actually, I'm giving you the one, two, three, four. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah. We're dear mother. Getting right in there on him. Oh, you were denied. Ooh, 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 ooh. You can just hear the hits taking place when we get around him like that. It's just a uh, rainstorm of, of violence. Cowabunga, indeed. Sewer surfing. Oh no, we all four ran into that. Way to go, turtles. My toes, my toes. <laughs> it was like, first obstacle, fail. Oh, we all got nailed by that one, too. That's okay. Oh, look, it's Alien. Making a, a sudden guest appearance in the Ninja Turtles game. It looks awfully alien-like. I don't know. The yellow alien. Oh, pizza, pizza, pizza time! That was a miracle. Only one turtle got hit through that. Oh, he was just standing there. What are you waiting for, foot soldier? An invitation to fight us? Shredder would be very disappointed. You have not been trained in the aggressive ways of foot soldiery. Oh, oh, there's some toes being... spiked. Oh, 
down you go. Just pounding through the foot soldiers. Bringing them. Uh-oh. Dang, I'm like 100% fail on those gates. Oh, wait, no. I think Donatello made it through that one. Just because he was flashing invulnerability. So many toes lost on this level. My poor turtles are just down to nubs on their kneecaps. What are you even supposed to do against these aliens? Oh, yeah, that's right, you just hit. These aliens aren't causing a lag on the game. This game seems to be very well ported. It runs smooth as butter no matter how much is going on on the screen. It hasn't slowed down once. Look at Leonardo with the life count, 47. Leonardo's just like extra fail. Sorry for talking over Shredder there. Prehistoric Turtle Saurus. Yeah, this game's fast and quick. It's like this game's all tens because the graphics have even been boosted up a little bit. The original Ninja Turtles got a seven on the graphics. I'd say this game's graphics are acceptable for the time period. Super fast, runs good. Yeah, this game's definitely all tens. A plus 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 plus. There will be other main games that I will be playing in the future that I will not be able to give such a good rating to, so <clears throat> I want to thoroughly sit back and be able to enjoy this one in all of its gloriousness. I believe the next episode is going to be Robocop Part 1 for the MAME. And then probably do Robocop Part 2. Those are some also some really good games on the arcade that I want to go and get some vengeance on. Oh, it's getting dark. Someone's turning the lights out. These rock guys are just incredibly hard. Beat their butts. This poor one foot soldier. It's always sad when there's always just one foot soldier left. <clears throat> and then I turn all four turtles on him. Look at this poor guy, he thinks he has a shot. Pizza power! pizza power thing kind of split us up a little bit. Go turtles! like Raphael is the <clears throat> master on this game. Oh, right, when I say that, he dies. He had the highest life count for a second there, at least. Reform, turtles. Now they're trying to be like Cadillacs and dinosaurs with this scene here. This reminds me a lot of Cadillacs and Dinosaurs. Which I have already done my playthrough of. It's in my archives if you want to see Cadillacs and Dinosaurs. I was able to, able to uh, cast that game at 60 frames a second. It turned out pretty smooth. Pizza time! Pizza time! Pizza time! This is only 30 frames a second right now.
Cement Man lives. Now some people pointed out to my attention that this should normally be the Rat King right here. Hmm. What is going on? My Red Clean Pro tried to grab my attention for a second there. Quit trying to beat up some enemies on Ninja Turtles. <laughs> no, this isn't supposed to be the Rat King, I don't think. It's like what they replaced him with on the arcade version. I was just playing this, I was streaming this before and somebody told me that this is where the Rat King normally is, I believe, on the console version or something. Some version of it. Getting a hurtin'. You're in a world of hurt, cement monster, the king guy. Get your boat over here, Don. <laughs> I bring him in, he knocks him down. That's nice that he comes to me after I reform the turtles. He's always standing right there for me to start attacking. Get him, turtles! Once again, with the excessive hit points, very difficult level. Uh, very difficult is what we have the difficulty setting on, which is like insane difficulty level, basically. You could imagine the amount of money I would have spent on this playing the arcade game at this point. Standing there just pumping the quarters in. Keep pumping those quarters in, kiddies. Man, Man I killed you. Cowabunga! Skull and crossbones! Army T, this must be the pirate level. <laughs> the lean in high five. Oh yeah, watch out for the loose planks. I'm gonna get my face smashed in many a time on this level. Oh, good job avoiding that one, toits. Twaddles. Ninja Toidles! I think that's how Bebop and Rocksteady say it. They say Ninja Toidles. I heard they are remaking the Ninja Turtles movie. Or they're making a new Ninja Turtles movie that's supposed to be pretty violent and pretty awesome more true to the original comic idea of the Ninja Turtles. I think all four of the Ninja Turtles will be wearing the red the red bandanas just like in the original and stuff. They're not going to be color-coded, Americanized. It should be pretty badical. <laughs> I have no idea on a release date or anything, but they're remaking everything these days, so might as well do the Ninja Turtles. I mean, they're already remaking Spider-Man, for goodness sakes. 
<laughs> that movie wasn't. Oh, two in a row, three in a row. Plank Central. We need to form up here, turtles. I think that is supposed to be a continuation, the Superman. Do you know if it's the same guy? Is it Brandon Roth playing Superman in the new one also? Henry Cavill? Henry Cavill? I, I didn't even know that. That's cool. I'm really hoping that they use Tom Welling for the Avengers for the movie coming up on a uh, movie where Superman's in it. I can't think of the name of the movie. I think it might be the Avengers or something like that. Justice League movie, yeah. Uh. Yep, Tom Welling for Justice League. He's gonna... To me, he's like the best modern-day Superman. He should have been the one used in all these Superman movies. Smallville is an awesome show. Done well, written well. Every episode was like you were watching a movie. It was just awesome. Pizza time! I feel seasick! Pizza time. Oh my friend, are you in for a treat? You are in for a treat. Ten seasons of that show, and that show gets so intense by the the eighth, ninth, and tenth seasons are just you're on the edge of your seat for like nine tenths of the episodes. You know, every season has a little bit of fluff episodes, but when the season, when the episodes come up where the storyline gets moving, incredible. <laughs> There's like scenes in there that just take your breath away. Sorry to sound like such a fanboy and stuff, but seriously. are going down. Huh, they added a little bit to the DC universe. That's yeah, just a uh, creative leeway. If you go back and watch the Superman movies originally, the, the part where they talk about Smallville is like a two-minute clip, if that. So they did, good, did a good job of taking that little idea and turning it into ten years' worth of solid television programming. And they're still hard today, my friend. They were hard in the arcade, and they're still hard on this. They have a ton of hit points. Do you know their names by chance? They do a bad job on this game of not telling you the enemy's name. That is one place where I will have to dock them points. I guess just everybody at the time was so aware of this game that you knew their names, you know. <laughs> nice! You guys need to run into each other more often like that. No. 
Yeah, Spike and Wolfie. Huh. I don't even know what this guy's name would be. <clears throat> I remember these guys from the movie. Yeah, these guys were in Return of the Ooze, the movie. I think this game came out probably around the same time as that movie did. This game came out in 1991. Somebody would have to check IMDB to see what year the Return of the Ooze came out. Razor is the wolf guy. Razor and Spike. I appreciate that, doofs. Or doof, whatever you want me to call you. I guess you'd have to let me know what you want me to call you. Tokar is the muted alligator. Uh, we'll be getting to him, I think, pretty soon here. Oh, it's Tokar? It's not Spike, huh? They are doing some serious flashing. I think we got them down on their last legs here. Oh, there went Tokar. Now he's just a little baby Tweedle. Oh, now you're gonna get the turtle supreme. Alligator snapping turtle is what they say he was, huh? Pretty specific, yeah. Bury my shell at the wounded knee. <laughs> Bury my shell at wounded knee. The train, train level. If anything's gonna make this stream lag, it's gonna be this level with the moving background like that. I'll be super ecstatic to hear that it doesn't lag once, though. Hey, it's a horse. Kevin Nash. Ooh, I feel seasick. Those rock guys have a lot of hit points just on their own. They take a minute or two to take down. Oh, you poor purple foot soldier. You got four turtle feet coming down at you at once, that can't feel good. <clears throat> four high kicks coming down from the toits. Oh, he was about to get the quad kick of doom, but I missed it. Quit hogging all the pizzas, Ralph. Pizza time. Raph. Raphael. Ooh, I feel 
What's with all the seasick? What's happening every time they say that? Oh, you get spun around. The enemy's grabbing me with the chain and giving me a whirl. I was gonna say, why? What's going on with seasick? We're on a train. Shouldn't they be saying like, I feel chain sick or something stupid like that? Turtles, we need to regroup. Oh, and then we die at the regroup point. Together we are stronger than we are apart. <laughs> Everything was just seasick back then. There was no motion sickness. Oh, goody! Pizza time! Pizza time! Oh, here's our alligator guy. <clears throat> this is probably the guy you're talking about. Tour rock or whatever. Taking us to town with his knives. Can't keep all four of us down at once. Turtle versus alligator muta mutated. This is real MMA mutated monster action. But um bump but um bump. I know. Nice hat, bro. Pink is definitely your style, man. That was definitely the style back then. Back in the days of in living color, you can do what you wanna do. In living color, and those girls, everyone on that show wore some pretty colorful outfits. Nice turtles are all spread out. Cowabunga! Cowabunga! High five! Neon Knight Riders. Neon Knight Riders, and the year is 2020, I guess. Bull crap! This is what it's going to be like in 2020. We had high aspirations back in the 90s, I think, what the future was going to be like in the 80s and 90s. Too much cocaine is what I blame it on. I know, 1999 and the year 2000 and everything just seems so futuristic and mysterious. Pizza time, pizza time. 
feels like I'm just failing super hard here. These guys with these guns are just taking me to town. We're just gonna stick to nailing everybody in the ground. the turn of the century. It didn't turn out to be such a big deal after all. No Y2K or nothing. Definitely still giving props to this ROM for not lagging at all with all this action on the screen. There has not been one bit of lag. Very well made. These dudes on these helicopters, I hate you. Yeah, I want one of these floaty majiggers when they come out too. Oh, Super Crane! You feel the wrath of Quad Turtle Force. Quad Power. Cheating. If I remember right, this fight is a good like 15 minutes just on its own. Hopefully not. We'll try to whoop them up quickly. That was just with one turtle though. Maybe with four turtles whooping on him it'll be a little quicker. I'm surprised the game hasn't spazzed out just because I've been controlling all four characters. Doesn't seem to mind that at all, though. Oh, you're tough, Super Crane. I'm not a believer in the jinx, so I'll say whatever I want, even. Random, there's a Bluetooth connection requesting to connect to my computer. Bluetooth device. It always makes you nervous when that pops up on your computer, like, who's trying to connect to the computer? This is creepy neighbors. I need to pause it to get the bubble out of the way down here. That seems to happen every so often around here. I'll get that thing, a request for someone to connect with the Bluetooth, but I have it set up to not allow it. So I'm not worried about it. <clears throat> no, I have it set up to not allow any other computers to use my internet connection as well, so there will be none of that. I'm not running wireless internet. <laughs> Just beating them up. Oh, you missed. <laughs> Somebody in there was getting a little extra mad. It's doing an extra attack. I 
Ah, it's doing it again. You're not. You are not connecting with your Bluetooth. I don't even have my Bluetooth device in plugged into the computer, so my Bluetooth doesn't work right now. So on top of everything else, that's just another reason why they wouldn't be able to connect. I don't have my Bluetooth antenna plugged in. You're going to pay. You're going to pay. Give myself a few more lives just in case. Starbase, where no turtle has gone before. Starbase. I think we're getting down to the, the nitty gritties here. It's the year 2100 now. I'm This game definitely gets a 10 for how many levels they have, too. This game's not just like a three levels and you're done. It has a multitude of levels. Lots of time to let you sink your quarters into the machine. Basically, is what that means. The more levels there are, the more time we keep you standing there. Playing. Or Moolah in the long run. Oh, there's more seasickness going on. Kawabunga! Robotic machines, what are these things? They gotta go down, those lasers are death. Mm, seasickness in space. You guys are going down. You caught up me right. Caught up with us right as we got into formation at the center of the screen. Power formation. Yep, this has definitely been a very difficult setting for sure. Look how many enemies have been on the screen like at any given moment. Twenty, maybe thirty. Now I'm too cool! Pizza time! Now I'm too cool! Pizza time! Now I'm too cool! Now I'm too cool! Ah, uh, that's a cool lighting effect. They have the lights fading in and out. Can we get out of this too cool zone, the vanilla ice? The vanilla ice hangout spot? I know Raphael's just tearing it up with 25 guys. They must have made him like extra good on this game or something. Nobody ever touches Raphael. Ooh, all four of us got toasted. 
That was like instant death too. Didn't stand a chance. Oh, get in the group. Oh, this is gonna get ugly now. We're gonna have to reform to make this work. Dang it. Got a boot to the face right as we were regrouping. That's kind of crazy, even though I'm controlling all these characters, they're all doing something different at most times, so it's kind of hard to tell at points that it is all being controlled by the same person. You shall have our death. Whoa. How many times you gotta fight Krang on these Ninja Turtle games? He's just there every time you turn around. Is <laughs> that the same turtle that kept getting the bubble? <clears throat> okay, it's a different turtle, it looks like. Oh, get your weak little robots out of here. Anyone got a pin? Anyone got a pin? Anyone got a pin? Regroup toits. Is he even flashing yet? I don't think he's even flashing yet. I'm I guess he I'm might be flashing trapped. a little bit there. Give him the goods, toits. The music just starts up again. I'm Being a little more cautious here at the end, don't know why. Oh. It's getting tired of hearing anybody have a pin, I guess. Oh right, you're about to go down, Krang. In your pink bubblegum colored spaceship. You're not intimidating anybody here. That holds our way home. Let's go. Hmm. 
I guess you can just walk into the television screen in the year 2100, too. Ooh, Technodrome, back to 1991, though. We are the turtles, yeah. Turtles. Just kidding. I was having them do a line dance for a minute there. Look at the size of this guy. Get off of me, Nash. Diamond Dallas Page. What's to do with his green sword? He's got the kryptonite sword. 